Hey YouTube, Matt here with Maple Mountain Fireplace. Today we're gonna to be talking about the difference between chimney pipe and stove pipe. So chimney pipe, class A chimney. This is rated at 2100 degrees. It's stainless steel inside and out. It holds up to the weather. It's made to be exposed to the elements. And black stove pipe is not. You cannot or should not install this double wall stove pipe through a wall, through an attic, or through your roof. It is dangerous and if you do that, it'll burn your house down. <laughs> so the only time you need stove pipe is to connect from your stove to the chimney connector. The arrow points the direction of the pipe. The top has a nice little twist lock connection for connecting the pipe. You just lock it in. It also comes with this band that goes around the seam with a little screw that's attached and you just tighten the band by tightening the screw. Now once you go through two by four construction or once you penetrate an outside wall, you must have class A chimney pipe. It's insulated for two reasons, okay? One, clearance to combustibles, two inches. You need two inches, cover with sheet metal, make sure you have that space two inches away from anything combustible, anything that'll burn. The black double wall, this has a clearance of six inches. So different clearances, different pipe, apples and oranges, they're not made to fit together. The chimney pipe is also insulated to protect against the cold. So if your exposed stove pipe is out in the cold weather, it's not insulated, it's going to get quite cold, it will cause the smoke to cool and condense and you'll have creosote which is that gooey sticky black stuff that gets all over your pipe but the danger with that is it will cause a chimney fire and we don't want any chimney fires so with the insulated pipe you're going to prevent chimney fires in most cases so along with our do-it-yourself videos Everything we sell will come with instructions on how to install this. Make sure that you're following not only the clearance on the pipe, but there's also clearance to combustibles for your wood burning stove or fireplace. So follow those clearances as well and make sure you're doing things up to code for your local region or building code, whatever that is, you need to find out. So here it is, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, give us a call. You can email us, check out our website, give us a like, subscribe, and thank you so much for watching.